really short day today. Um, you had a picture on page 199 that you might want to look at. I can't draw it to give it justice. So I'm just going to tell you to look at it. It's on page 199 in the middle of the page. They're talking about the triangle inequality theorem, which is that thing right there. It says the sum of the links of two of the links, sum of the links of any two sides of a triangle are greater than the third side of the triangle. What that means is that you cannot have a third side of the triangle that is less than whatever those two are. In fact, you can't even have it equal to, which is what they have a picture of on page 199. They show you that if it's equal to, you can break up that line anywhere. If it's equal to, like if this was the bottom of it right here, you can break it up anywhere, but you're never gonna be able to make that triangle because by the time you get close enough for it to actually touch to make that triangle, then it's already back to that line. So you cannot have the third side even be equal to the sum of those two sides. It's always gonna have to be less than the sum of any two sides of that triangle. And it doesn't matter which two sides of the triangle you're talking about. The other two sides would also have to be less than. So if we had a triangle that had sides four, five, and six, that would work because four plus five is nine, nine is more than six. Five plus six is 11, 11 is more than four. Six plus four is 10, 10 is more than five. It's just got to be more than the third side. But we cannot have sides that are like 5, 5, and 10 because 5 plus 5 is 10. Now it's true that 10 and 5 is 15, which is more than that other 5, but 5 plus 5 is 10 and it has to be greater than 10 for it to make a triangle. You cannot have sides that are like 5, 6, and 12 because they're not even gonna meet. So they won't even create a, a straight line. Um, the five and the six won't. So the five and six would have to add up to be more than the third side. Okay, a lot of words to say just that. Classwork for today on page, gotta find it, 202. See, you're already in the 200s, oh my gosh. Okay, on page 202, classwork is just problems two and six, homework is just problems four and eight. Now, I know that seems pretty lame, probably very exciting actually, but pretty lame nonetheless. So this is all the classwork and homework that you have. Here's the deal. That's all the classwork and homework that you have, but I'm planning on putting together a little kind of review for you for the test. And if it becomes a hefty review like it was for the last chapter, then you'll have an extra day in there to do classwork. If you don't have a hefty review like you did for the last chapter, then you'll just have the review and you'll take the test and you'll have to have that day in between. And that's up to you. I don't care how you guys fix it up. I'm just telling you what it's gonna be. Okay, bye.